Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Recreating. Today we have Brick Bazooka custom figure. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so here he is, Brick Bazooka. This was by far the easiest one to repaint or remake or recreate, whatever you guys want to call it. Um, out of the whole line of characters from small soldiers um, if you guys haven't seen those videos go back and check those videos out um, this was the easiest one there is some stuff i added to it of, as you guys could tell um, I, I did add the bands to his um, arm and to his uh, uh, thigh um, there's a little part in the movie where he does come apart and then they put them back together and they put uh, band-aids on him So I decided to put those on it. I thought it was a pretty cool little touch being that this guy was really easy to uh, remake um, except <laughs> Except for the pants guys the pants the, these stripes I, I, I just can't figure out the color of these stripes man. I've tried every single freaking color in the rainbow and it, it just it just it doesn't match this was the closest one i got but when it dried up it dried up like this and i don't like it it doesn't look like the actual one the actual one looks a little bit more brighter or shinier and it, that's what it looked like when i first painted him when it was still when the paint was still wet it looked exactly like the one in the video but when it dried up it looked like this i don't understand what happened if you guys know what color exactly what color it is that he uses for the stripes on here for the com for the camouflage uh, stripes let me know in the comments down below please i appreciate it so much so i could repaint the whole thing and make it look more screen accurate um i i'll still continue to do it until i figure out exactly what color it is and then i'll repaint the pants but other than that guys um i did repaint these uh little pack packs and the little uh, holster or whatever you guys want to call it here on the side um brown so it could match this this i did make a little bit bigger if you guys know if you guys have this toy this uh little patch up here is a little pad up here it's a little bit smaller um i did make it a little bit bigger to make it more screen accurate um these these little things i did make them pop out so there are 3d um and this is all epoxy i just cut them out to squares and i put them all on there as far as the shirt i i if i do post that video on how to remake this guy um uh, i'll show you guys that i went to like three different shirts to make sure it's the right color i did win with the lighter shirt because i thought it was really cool to make him look with the lighter shirt but i was like eh, it doesn't look screen accurate so i'll just make it look the way it is on the on the movie so that's why i picked this color as far as the face i just put a little bit of uh details into it i put a little bit of shading into it so you guys could see the face a little bit better so his features could stick out a little bit more a little pop out on his features i did paint the hair a little bit darker because it was way too bright yellow um as far as the bazooka i left it there is um all these all these toys have little gimmicks they have the little features that they do little special little things that they do i don't know why they do that on toys that are based on movies and stuff like that i don't understand why they do stuff like this um i'm not mad at it i'm not disappointed or anything but it just makes it hard for me <laughs> um but anyways i did leave the bazooka on this guy because he is brick bazooka so i was like uh yeah leave the bazooka on there um but as far as the seam he doesn't do his little uh Originally, this head fo uh, moves forward. You guys don't have the toy. His head moves forward. Uh, the bazooka f flings forward, and it's just like sticking out like that. Um, I didn't like it. I didn't like that little gimmick. So I sealed it up with epoxy, so you guys can't see the seam anymore. There's a little seam. If you guys have the toy, there's a little seam going right here. You guys can't see that anymore because I covered it all up, and I repainted the whole thing. I left it on like I said because he is brick bazooka by the way so I was like I'll just leave it on originally I was gonna cut it off like I did the other character let me show you guys there he is um, this is the same character I just uh, remade him if you guys haven't seen the video go back and check it out I cut off the whole bazooka because he doesn't eat it but he does he's brick bazooka so I decided to leave it on there 
So I was like, ah, I'll just leave it on there. Why cut it if he's break bazooka? And later on, I will make the missiles for this guy. I'll make the missile pack and I'll attach it to this dude later on. Um, but yeah, other than that, that's basically it. And I just painted the boots a little bit silver here, and the sole of the boots I painted those too. And I really like this, the little straps around here. Um, and the little sticks. I thought it was a little cool little touch to it. it. Makes them look a little bit a little bit more screen accurate. I love putting these guys together uh, in a bundle with all the other characters. They look really cool together. Um, anyways. But that's it. <laughs> that's basically it. This guy was, like I said, he was the easiest one to do out of all the other toys that I made. Um, so I saved them for last. So actually, it's not the last one. Because I am going to make Link Static. Um, but I just haven't found the right character for it. Like I had, oh, I, I am gonna use Nick Nitro for him, but I just haven't found a good price for him on eBay. I don't want to waste too much money. Uh, the cheapest one I found on eBay was twenty five dollars. I don't want to use twenty five dollars for it because I am gonna custom um, paint them and I am gonna uh, cut off some stuff and you know remake them into Link Static. So I don't want to waste too much money into it. Like I'll, I'll, I'll use fifteen, ten to fifteen dollars at the most. To get a nick nitro and then if i find that and then i'll buy it and i'll make a nick nitro and um you guys could see that maybe <laughs> um i do want to rant for a little bit guys i'm sorry um i just want to say that uh, i do appreciate you guys all you guys who have been there from the very beginning edward um and all you other guys that have been there from you know from day one supporting all of my stuff and been leaving comments down below and leaving the like clicking on the like button i appreciate you guys so much um alex uh, kathleen uh you're awesome thank you so much for the support for you know uh, edward littleton thank you most so much for the support man and uh, uh, bionic turtle you've been supportive too um there's a lot of you guys i'm sorry i can't man name you from the you know from the top of my head i just i'm not looking at my phone or anything to see your names it just you know those are the only names that popped out for now um but everyone has supported me thank you guys so much for supporting me uh, i just want to say that i probably won't make any more videos <laughs> i know i'm sorry guys it's just that i feel like i'm not where i want to be on youtube i've been doing this for a while i've been doing a lot of videos and i, I I just crossed over the 200 subscriber count. 200. 200. <laughs> and it's uh, I've been doing this for a while and I've been busting my butt day in and day out. Uh don't get me wrong, I love doing this stuff because, you know, it's 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 my little thing that I do and it helps me relax and it's my little hobby and I love repainting these guys, but to put it on video, you know, take my time to put it on video and edit the whole thing and uh, upload it to youtube it does take a whole lot of my time it, it really does like uh, for you for you guys that that do videos yourselves you guys know what i mean like to edit everything especially the ones that i show you guys how to make these guys uh, i'm not sure i'm gonna do that anymore because it does take a whole lot of time guys it, it it's just so much time consumed doing those videos and on top of it on top of it making these uh characters and then editing everything and then uploading it takes forever and i just haven't been motivated to do it like i really haven't been motivated that's why i haven't uploaded a video in a long long time guys i apologize <sighs> i just uh, i'm not motivated to do it anymore because of the views that i've got like i i, I don't know and youtube's all screwed up right now youtube's all they just pushing their agenda. They're just, you know, they're picking people that they want to be viewed. If it's not good enough for them, they don't want to share your videos and stuff like that. So if you guys are a fan of this, uh, and you guys do want to help out the channel, if you guys want me to keep doing videos and stuff like that for you guys, help me out, guys, if you guys can. Just share my videos with as much people as you can, as much people as you know. Share these videos. Tell them to subscribe to the channel. Um share my videos on your social medias like twitter or uh facebook and instagram and so on and so forth um, because i know youtube is not going to do this for me uh they haven't been doing it for me for a long time um they nitpick and everything and if you're 
videos don't show about um, uh, like uh, cosmetics or show you how to dress or it doesn't it's not a it's not a famous person on YouTube then they won't share your videos basically is you know so the smaller people get screwed over so that's basically what's happening here so I feel like I'm wasting my time doing these videos and I apologize for all you guys who have been supportive to the channel. Like, I don't want to leave you guys down. I might just do, like, review videos. I won't show you guys how I made the character. I'll just show you the review, the, you know, the end piece of it or the the finished product. And then I'll just review the finished product. Because I, I do have some Dragon Ball Z characters that I made. And I didn't record them because I was like, uh, I don't know if I should upload them anymore. Because I don't know if people are actually watching this stuff anymore. That Brawly character that i made i only had like 50 views and you know how long that guy took me to make you know how long the video process took me to make <laughs> it took me forever to make like uh, you guys don't understand it took me like f almost a whole week to make that guy like literally a whole week worth of hours to make that guy and i only got 50 views so i don't know if it's worth it for myself to make even more videos and just i'm just wasting my time making videos i I don't know guys i really don't know anymore i don't, I don't know if i'm gonna keep uploading stuff uh, i'll just like i said i love doing this stuff for myself and it help it, it it helps me relax to make these little characters and stuff like that and eventually i will sell these guys for a profit so um like the characters i make i'm, I'm eventually i am gonna sell those guys to make money off of them but as far as making videos I don't know. I'm kind of over it, guys. I like I I, I want to quit making videos. I don't want to be on YouTube anymore because YouTube is really biased. Um, YouTube really really sucks right now, and I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, guys. Stay tuned, I guess, to find out whether I make videos anymore. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just not motivated right now, but. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I don't want to bore you guys anymore with my, my rant. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you guys watching. If you enjoyed this, please don't forget to, to hit the thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what color this little stripe things are so I could repaint it. Make them look more screen accurate. I appreciate you guys if you guys do. Leave a comment down below. Let me, get, let me know what you guys think. Share your video if you guys want. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys. If you guys do subscribe, guess what? You guys will see me on the next one. Peace.